Let's talk about how to maximize muscle growth. So at the rec center, there's a uh, young kid by the name of Joe. He's literally a, a high school kid there. He's also a lifeguard and I've seen him training there before. And he's uh, probably, a, he's literally in high school. He's probably about 130 pounds, small frame, maybe like 5'4". And he wants to get as big as possible. He wants to get huge. You know, he wants to put on a lot of muscle and he's uh, also playing football in high school. And, you know, he just wants to put on a lot of size. He's really, he's actually really, really strong. I've trained with him. He's incredibly strong, but he's super, super small and thin and, you know, small build. So he tells me, he says, I said, what are you doing uh, for your, you know, are you taking amino acids? What are you doing? He's like, yeah, I'm taking a BCAAs and I'm also getting whey protein isolate. I'm like, okay, good, man. And, you know, I'm really, I'm happy for him. He's doing a good job. But I want to talk about what I'm doing and how to maximize the gains in the way of, of muscle growth and exactly, you know, what I told him. And I think it's going to help a lot of other people. So if your goal is anything like this, like Joe's, of getting maximum muscle gains, it's absolutely essentially important that you take Frank Zane's, legendary Frank Zane's advice, and you seek out the best quality whey protein concentrate for the leucine in the whey protein concentrate, all right? So, Orny Hoffmeck, who wrote The Warrior Diet, I consider the, the master on this subject, he talks about how whey protein concentrate is gonna be more of a time-released method of amino acid release to the body, as opposed to whey protein isolate, which is gonna be a little bit more of a shotgun. So a good way to uh, talk, to kind of look at it is like, say, taking a shot of alcohol, you know, like, that's what whey protein isolate would be kind of like. And then whey protein concentrate is going to be more like having a beer and getting a buzz over time, you know, or throughout the night, right? So it's going to be more of a shot. And one thing about the, the whey protein isolate, once the muscles absorb that, the amino acids, they can't take in anymore. So you're, you're maxed out on recovery. Same thing goes for BCAAs. Ori Hoffmanger says the reason he doesn't recommend any BCAAs is because the BCAAs are like, almost like intravenously going into the muscles and aiding recovery. And so any other uh, amino acids like from food, uh, whey protein concentrate or good, good natural sources are gonna be completely wasted because the BCOAs have completely tricked the muscles into thinking that's all they can handle. They can't handle anymore. So that's why whey protein concentrate is so, so essential. So I recommended to Joe for the maximum muscle gains. The way I take it is 30 minutes before training. Okay, that's the best way to do it. Do fasted, completely fasted, 18 hours, even 20 hours, intermittent fasting. Then train, but you wanna, I wanna have amino acids in my system in the way of whey protein concentrate. And if I'm staying fasted, I wanna have whey protein concentrate again after training, 30 minutes after. That's recommended by Roy, Ari Hoffmeckler, and it's completely helped me in incredible gains, incredibly putting on muscle and losing fat, all right? So let's talk about what I'm taking now in the way of whey protein concentrate. So for the past, like, say, uh, three months or so, thank you for the Keto Body Forum, where I learned about this uh, type of protein. I've been taking this now brand whey protein concentrate natural unflavored cheapest place i found it was on iherb or it was like 20 dollars, maybe 22 dollars. very very good brand it's a gallon and a half i highly recommend it it's a good brand but okay i went ahead and, and i made a slight adjustment only because of you know what i've understood over years about protein so in the, that type of protein the whey protein concentrate in the now brand they heat the protein up extremely high they heat the whey up extremely high. It's called uh, heat pasteurization. And by doing that, it actually kills off a lot of the beneficial uh, elements in the amino acids in the protein. Now, it's still incredibly good, but it's not maximized uh, efficiency. All right, so from years ago, I learned about glutathione. And glutathione is actually an amino acid in the body produced and triggered only by a weird format. It's actually only triggered by cold processed whey protein concentrate from grass fed cows. Don't ask me why, I have no idea. But the glutathione in the body is like this super hormone. It's like this super hormone inside the body that's triggered from eating whey protein concentrate from grass fed cows, cold processed, all right? So not only is the glutathione being triggered, it's not being ingested. You can't actually take glutathione as a supplement. It's naturally in the body, but it's somehow it's triggered from the grass-fed uh, grass cows that make the whey protein uh, concentrate that's cold processed, okay? So by doing that, it basically leads to maximum recovery, anti-aging, incredible, incredible effects, incredible strength gains. It's monumentally different. And so for almost the same price, but buying in bulk, it's a little bit more. I paid $79 and I got this, uh, I'll show you what I got. 
So for almost like very similar price, um, $79 compared to like say $22 for a gallon and a half to $79 for a ga uh, five gallons. So if you're on a tight budget, the other one's probably gonna be better because you could buy less at a time. But this one was on Amazon, it's five gallons, Pro Mix, you can see it okay, Pro Mix. All right, this is a grass-fed way, cold process, processed, unflavored, packed full of amino acids, and it triggers the glutathione in the body. Doesn't say anything about triggering the glutathione, but it, it truly does. This is also, see the ingredients there, it says grass-fed, cold processed, you know, ton of amino acids. So that's just a little insider secret that I have learned, okay, from experience, from research, from buying. From five years ago, I'd buy this grass-fed whey protein concentrate, cold processed, for like double this for five gallons. I mean, even like $200. Like $200, I paid about five, five, six years ago, about 2010, 2011, I would buy this for $200, this type of protein. Now it's come down considerably. There's more available in the market on M and Marketplace on Amazon made this a go before, it was only $79. So for the value, this is the best thing you're gonna find. And, and here's the other crazy thing about it. I wanna show you, that's just, just very, very interesting. So with like the grass-fed whey protein concentrate, man, the stuff is freaking yellow, man. It's yellow. Look at that, bro. Freaking yellow, man. Let's see that, man? There you go. See that? Yellow. It's freaking yellow. The now brand is white. So that tells me that it truly has not been heat pasteurized, right? Damaging the, the, the precious and valuable amino acids inside of it. That tells me that it's really been cared for. And it also, it tells me Call me insane, crazy, I don't care. But it tells me that the animals, right? Because it's literally, you know, we got to give love and, and gratitude. The animals that produced this were happy. That's what it tells me. The animals who produced this were very happy. They were loved. They were, they were in their natural environment eating grass. You know, that's what cows eat. They eat grass, they're vegetarian animals. So when cows are fed other things, corn and ground up dead animals is just they're not happy you know they're not healthy so the, the the milk they produce is just not the same and then when it's heated up tremendously it turns white and that's not the natural color the natural color is actually yellow all right so you know tremendously uh making a change going to the grass-fed whey protein concentrate cold processed the cheapest deal i found for the best value was pro mix Another brand was called Naked. It's on Amazon. It's a little bit more expensive, but this is just as good, if not better. The reviews are phenomenal on here. It's been out for a minute. And literally, I paid twice as much for this about five years ago. So, so uh, Joe, you know, he's, he's literally, you know, the kid is, uh, he's in high school and he gets, wants to get maximum gains. So Joe or anyone else who's at that like 130 build, just wanting to put on maximum muscle without getting a lot of fat, it's incredibly essential that you feed the muscles the proper amino acids because that's what's going to create the recovery. All right, that's what's gonna create the recovery. Getting it from food is good, you know, good proteins and you know, healthy, healthy, good organic meats is good, but if you're doing intermittent fasting, the, the warrior diet strategy, the intermittent fasting strategy, shout out Greg Gallagher again for you know, make, giving this, teaching me this amazing strategy, and I've been doing it for about nine months now. If you're doing that strategy, you know, you gotta have the whey protein concentrate because your muscles are craving that. Without it, they could literally start, you know, could, uh, eating themselves, you know, eat, you know, eating the amino acids inside their muscles and it creates you know, loss of muscle. So if you're doing the amino fasting, you definitely don't want to wait without amino acids and these are the best forms. All right, hope you found a lot of value in this video. If you did, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I really appreciate all the new subscribers, love, gratitude. Leave a comment what you think about this, you know. Am I, am I far out there? Am I way out there? Am I freaking, you know, going extreme? But I'm just telling you, my own you know, experience this has been very profound. I, I started using this type of product over, over six years ago. It just wasn't affordable after that until recently I rediscovered it. Now it's affordable again. All right. Thanks for watching. Done. One more thing. So check this out. So even on the directions, it says on training days, mix two scoops of 12 to 16 ounces of water or carbohydrates post-workout beverage within 30 minutes of your workout. On non-training days, use one to three times daily in addition to meals uh, as a protein supplement. So, I mean, they're really dead on with that. The only thing is, is if you're trying to get lean and shredded, you don't want to use the carbohydrates 
post-workout ever. Don't ever mess with the carbohydrates. You want to just keep it with, with the uh, with water. This and water. Now I get you know if you're a freaking runner or you know marathon runner or a cyclist or something, then you know that could be totally different. You know, don't listen to me. But again, I'm just I'm just talking about getting lean, shredded, and aesthetic. For that, you do not want to make put carbohydrates inside of the um, inside of the mix. There. Here's a look at the uh, amino acid content. See the leucine, three thousand milligrams of leucine in three in two scoops. That's like the the key one. And if you notice, like it doesn't mention anything about glutathione on here. And so, don't ever buy glutathione. It's a waste of your money. Okay, but do your own research. But I'm telling you. Glutathione is a little secret hormone in the body that's triggered only by this type of protein. Cold processed, grass fed cows, branch chain amino acids. Uh, comes from the pro mix way, comes from milk of grass fed heritage breed cows. Cold processed microfiltration produces a non denaturated whey protein with superior bioavailability and unsurpassed amino acid pro profile. Rich in naturally occurring immunoglobins, lactoferrin, CLAs, L-carnitine, glutathione. See, it's not an ingredient, but it knows. And growth factors. Promix pro mixes instantly with water. So, and it mixes incredibly, incredibly fast. I mean, this stuff mixes right away. And it mixes, I mean, I just barely stirred with a spoon with a, with a knife. And it tastes different than the Now brand. No doubt about it. It can taste a lot different. Oh, man. Incredible. One last thing, check this out. The Now brand versus this, see how this ProMix, it says naturally contains glutathione. Now again, glutathione is not a supplement. It's something that's actually triggered in the body. It's not even an ingredient, it's not even an amino acid profile, but it's, it's inside this because it's triggered from this specific type of protein, right? Cold processed, grass fed cows. Look at the Now brand, nothing about glutathione. Nothing about glutathione. Not that it's bad. I've been taking this for three months and it's great. It's helped me out tremendously. It's great. But literally for, I mean, it's like a hair, a hair more just buying in bulk. You're, I'm getting a night and day difference of a product. So I, I don't know. I think you can tell I'm just passionate about this because this, this stuff is no, no joke. And I know the, the, the quality of this type of, uh, this type of protein is in, incredible. So Freaking tremendous value, man. Let me. This video's gone on long enough. I appreciate it. Freaking all amazing. You know, I'm excited about it and passionate about it because it's, I know that the, the amount of value or the amount of uh, quality in that protein is such a big difference. And math wise, I'm not a freaking math whiz, but look, look at it. A gallon and a half for, I think it was 22 gallons, $22 versus $80 for five gallons. Night and day difference in quality. So if you're on a budget, I would, I would highly recommend. If you're on too tight of a budget, get the other one. Otherwise, stick with them out now, Brand. You're still doing really good with it, okay? Done!